Beatles anniversary of some sort to somebody somewhere. Well, right now, Paul is celebrating the fifth year of the Beatles Cirque du Soleil show, Love, in Las Vegas. And that's where I sat down for an exclusive interview with the man you can now call Mr. Mom. I have custody of my little one after my divorce. I have half time with her. So when I'm with her, yeah. I'm just phone dad. I'm at 6.30 in the morning, doing the school run. Hi, other moms. It's, it's like that. And it's really, you know, just dad. You actually go to the, uh, the pick-up line and pick up the... Oh, yeah. Beatrice. Oh, yeah. With the other moms. Mm. How fun. Yeah, it was great. Chit-chat about the latest recipes. And also, you know, I think it's nice if a kid has that. Paul McCartney. You are here, there, and everywhere. Right now, Paul is splitting his time between being Mr. Mom, his seven-year-old daughter, Beatrice, and his on-the-run tour that will find him playing two dates at Yankee Stadium next month. It's not really like touring. You know, used to tour, used to go out for three, four months. Now it's kind of, we do a few dates, and then I go back to being the dad, and then we go on again, so it's, the whole year is like that. Oh, I caught up with Paul in Las Vegas where he took in the fifth anniversary performance of Cirque du Soleil's The Beatles Love. Backstage, he congratulated the performers. What can I say? I said thank you, you know. That's nasty. Music's not bad. <laughs> <laughs> Paul, you turned 69 on Saturday, but he's not slowing down. In 2012, maybe even busier. Olympics coming to London 2012. Will you be involved? Have they asked you? I can't imagine an opening ceremony without you in it. I hear there's a rumor. I haven't actually heard any yet, but I hear they're planning uh, this sort of music, and I do hear there's a little rumor that you might be involved. That I might be involved, yeah. I met the guy who knows the guy who is going to ask somebody about it soon. Tomorrow on Access Hollywood, the gold standard in entertainment news, the hottest bods in Hollywood, we reveal who made